the next topic in your book is specifying alignments now what is alignment you have studied this alignment topic in class 4 as well now i will revise it once again alignment refers to the placement of text on a slide okay if you remember in class 4 also you have studied about alignments left alignment center alignment justify alignment and right alignment in the same way in microsoft powerpoint there are two ways in which the alignment can be the alignment of the text can be adjusted either you can adjust it in horizontal or vertical now how to do this you can see this is the paragraph group okay you have select your text okay select the text now what you need to do is go to the paragraph group okay and here you will find align text button okay this is align text button and there is a small drop down click on this drop down you can see top middle bottom top middle and bottom you can see the difference as i'm moving all right now in the same way this is are the two ways in which you in the placeholder itself you can make your alignment on the top of the placeholder center of the placeholder and bottom of the placeholder this is your vertical alignment and the second one is horizontal alignment in which paragraph group left alignment center alignment right alignment and justify alignment all right so keep remember that in microsoft powerpoint there are two ways in which you can make your text aligned the first is vertical top middle bottom and second one is horizontal align text left center right and justify